Candice uh, said in the video that, like, maybe you remember that competition of who has the best story, who is the, has the most painful story. And I, like, before I did the 12 empowerments, I would have been like me. I'm definitely, like, looking around in the top, well, five, I would say, <laughs> here. So, uh, um, basically, it was like, like my childhood was not the easiest one. There was like a lot of sexual abuse, emotional abuse from very young childhood, um, violence, like lots of things that I would have like label not easy and quite painful. And um, that's basically with what I identified before I did the 12 empowerments. And um, I, of course, I did a lot of things like to do therapy and try to heal this and try to overcome it. But basically, like when you met me, I within I don't know maybe an hour, I would have like told you half of my life story and uh, called myself a victim of that or even like a survivor. And I was very much supported in this by society, I think, and that's what I learned. And that was also the ground from uh, where I related. So uh, feeling like a victim and especially to my family, of course. So very often I would, uh, most of the time I, I felt like, um, like very accu accusative. Um, Everything I did and I thought I did wrong or what I didn't like about me, like being re reactive a lot or being angry a lot, I could r actually relate to my childhood and I had a good reason. I had prob the right to be like that because this is, you know, what you get when you're being treated like this. So it was c somehow all in place, but of course um, it was not such a nice way of relating to people, relating to myself. And um, yeah, and then after having done so much already, I, I met the 12 empowerments. And then I heard that I'm perfect as I am. And I've, I've never heard that before, I think. And I think <coughs> I shared that before. I, I just like cried for days when uh, I met this training from relief, actually. And um, yeah, and then, then the 12 empowerments, I had the chance to actually look at all of the belief systems and all of the ways I related to people, all of my relationships where there were lots of not harmonized relationships. I, I would even say most of my relationships were kind of not very harmonized. And... Um, yeah, it was, it was a very interesting journey and it felt so very, very real. I, like from the beginning, I just knew that I have tapped into something that was absolutely real. Like it sounded like that to me and also just looking at the people, looking at the people in Balanced View, it, it was so obvious that there was something there that I totally wanted. I wanted to have this peace of mind. I wanted to look so relaxed in all your features. It feels like your life story starts to fade in your, in your every cell because of the relaxation. And um, yeah, and then I would say the 12 empowerments was the start of actually turning my life around completely. I can honestly say that there is not one relationship in my life that is not harmonized. Um, like taking the example of my family is like I've always been, I always felt like a, an outsider of my families. Like they surely did not understand me. They were completely different than I was. Um, and I, yeah, I was very angry at that, at, at them. I always looked for someone to be responsible for all of that. And I really wanted someone to be responsible. And now there's like nothing of that left anymore. I've just spent 10 days uh, at home over Christmas and it's been the most beautiful and loving time ever. And it also feels a little bit like just my participation in this training is kind of like, yeah, doing something within the, um, 
uh, like relating within my family. It, it, it just, yeah, oozing out into everything. It's like we're laughing all the time. We're like loving all the time. And I'm always sometimes taking a short moment being like, wow, when did that happen? <laughs> so beautiful, really. And um, yeah, I, I'm, I'm so, yeah, much more able now to take short moments with almost everything. I've been very reactive all my life. And um, there's this beautiful example. I think I've told it sometimes, but it sticks with me so much. It's, um, I, I ask one question. I mean, I've asked lots of questions in the empowerment, I think. But there's one question I ask. Um, and that is related to my hearing. I'm hard of hearing, and therefore I have a lot of sounds that um, are really, really hard for me to, um, yeah, like be with. And one of them is whistling. When people whistle, it's like, or oh, it's horrible for my for my ears. And I remember asking the question in the empowerment, and said, yeah, but how can I take a short moment with that? And then Toby said, um, he gave an explanation and said, well. It can be both there, the annoyance about the whistling and the relaxation of, then they would be in the same room. And it was like, okay, yeah, I understand that somehow. <laughs> Intellectual, uh, like, and then like, I tried it with everything. I think this is what like a short moment is for me a little bit, like, okay. I still have all these reactive things coming up quite easily. That hasn't changed so much. But um, first of all, I can have the relaxation in the same space very often. And I don't need to react so, so much anymore. I don't need to like, you know, I've always asked, can you please stop whistling? I can't take that. So that was the first thing. <laughs> like I've I always try to make people stop what they're doing in order not to <laughs> get on my nerves. I sometimes still do that, but uh, mostly in a very nice way. And uh, very often I don't say anything because it's fine to be annoyed. It's fine to be annoyed. Um, and so many things are fine now. It's fine to be hurt. It's fine to be bored. It's fine to be angry. It's fine to sing a uh, wrong tune at a concert. It's just fine. I don't need to bash myself up anymore so much, and I don't need to bash anyone else up so much anymore. And that's, uh, yeah, it's just such a relief. Yeah, so um, very, very beautiful to be able to do that, very peaceful inside.